explain to me what we're doing today. <laughs> you can do that. <laughs> yeah, uh, today we are fitting a dozer cab kit and base station for GPS. Do you have to explain to us what's happening now? I'm just putting some magnets on the um, LCR3 so they can go into the bracket in the cab. Cool. So it's all tidy and nice in the way. So Jade's behind me on the machine doing her thing, fitting stuff, getting ready to go. Um, I think Dave's trying to find a power supply over there. Um, if any of you recognise this site, we did a drone survey here um, around about a month ago and surveyed all these stockpiles here um, so that the client could then have a model drawn up and that model is going to go onto this machine so that a dozer driver can literally just put his foot down and basically get rid of all these stockpiles um, and spread it out across this area. Uh, this is private land, this is someone's garden as amazing as that is. Um, so using the machine control and the dozer it's going to be a quicker job, it's going to be more efficient and um, it's going to be really interesting because I've actually never used, you know, 16 years in I've never used or seen machine control but it's something that's happening in construction all the time now for efficiency and cost saving and um, I'm excited. <coughs> on most of your jobs. <laughs> so we need above. main above. Yeah. Inside from there. Yeah behind, mm -hmm. width of the blade, and then above, above inside. inside from the right, yeah. behind measurement for that one. Okay. What are you doing now then Jade? A position check in the dozer, so hopefully it will be in the right, be in the right place. Good, good, <laughs> good. <laughs> So that reading there, it gives you like a plus or a minus of where you're at? This plus or minus is, is your offset. Yeah. So if you wanted it, if this was a car park and they were putting 200 mil of stone, 100 mil of tarmac, you could put that as uh, minus 0 0.3, 300 mil set. And it'll tell you, you got how far to go down to get that level Damn. so level is always finished level right got you so you can put a plus or a minus in for what you're doing so if they wanted to put 200 mil of topsoil in or whatever you could scrape this out to minus 200 and then go back over it when your topsoil comes at finished level and grade it off and what so in terms of controlling the machine is it literally just forwards and backwards and the, the blade works itself? No, driver will go forwards and backwards. When he hits auto, it only works when it's in this little green band. So whatever that's set at, on grade is 61 mil. So plus or minus 61 mil is when the auto cuts in to give you your final. So then it will control the blade up, down and twist. Nice, okay. Sorry? Fit him. Fit him, fit him from? And you're going to be the machine driver today? I'm going to be the machine driver on the dozer. <laughs> Never driven machine control, but no, very good with a dozer, so we'll be fine. I'm going to do my best. Yeah, yeah, cool, cool. And you guys do groundworks for Ground big projects? Groundworks for big projects. All right, so anyone with any huge projects out there, hit this guy up. No problem. <laughs> Put his link in the description. Uh, East 455. Yep. 165. Yep. 0.388. Yep. 
Northern is 311 Yep. Nine Jade and Dave have done their job, the machine is up and away. Job in the bag.